Our building is pretty, pretty simple in that. It's basically sixth grade, parallel hallway, seventh grade. This is some of our electives, um, some of our special ed programs, then eighth grade. And then down the far side is cafeteria, theater, choir, band, PE athletics. So these are all of our seventh grade teachers that okay. have been misplaced. And so displaced because of the storm? Displaced oh, because man. of so water damage that we have down oh, here. Man. So back there where that yep. um, oh. patch is. So behind that is was was the pipe that, that burst. Whoa. And it just ate a hole in that and didn't like it wasn't like a fire hydrant right. where it was just spurting out because nothing really got damaged. It right just came out there. and just kept pouring out. But wow. uh, so yeah, she's been in here a little bit trying to get things reorganized and oh, man, back to where it needs to be. <laughs> this is sad. So we'll actually head down this hallway. We'll see oh, theater sure. and choir. Yeah, so Miss Strain. So yeah, so, yeah, so you can see Miss Strain on the other side um, at home. She's taking the tennis, getting that stuff done. They're memorizing lines, but they're still trying to put together a production. Um, How does that work? We're actually going to pull off some Shakespeare this year. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. So well, and so they've just started um, rehearsing. I want to see this. So they're going to do a Midsummer Night's Dream. Oh. This is a seventh grade boys choir. Start over, please. Go ahead. One, two, three, four, five. Louder, come on. This is just their normal starts and warm ups. Oh, I love this. Look at this engagement. Before we get to that mirror, we're going to hang a left into Miss Casillas's. I think she's got uh, an on level eighth grade class. Hey, Marshall. So is this. Again, virtual and in person yeah, as well. So every, yeah, every classroom you'll see, you'll be both. So the same. So what Marshall's seen, like you can, he has his own square up there because she's checking it as she goes. If he's done it right or wrong, she can also then talk with him directly. Or if he were at home, she can still connect back. Teacher just doing whatever they can to make it happen. So we're also sharing spaces too. So we have ICAP, we have SESS sharing some space. We have two different ICAP um, units, an ICAP C unit, two SESS teachers, and then two goals programs as well. Wow. So did you like have to figure out the whole Google Classroom like before? Oh, yeah. I'm old. I did not. <gasps> I don't know how to work it either. Yeah. So I had to learn everything. I had to learn Zoom. I had to learn everything. I knew none of that. But you made it From happen. Wow. It had to happen. Today's visit to RBMS was probably one of my favorite. What I saw today was a group of educators willing to do whatever it takes. As soon as you walk into the building here, you feel that community right away. This year, RBMS has faced so many obstacles with COVID, but also with the snowstorm. So being able to see our educators and our administration here at RBMS pull together and make it work for our students is just what LASD is about. Thank you, RBMS, for allowing me to tour your school, and I can't wait to come back next year.